Greetings comrades, my name is Gigantles and today is Maundy Thursday so it is currently day 38 out of 40 of Lent if you don't fast on Sundays and day 46, at, no day 44 out of 46 if you do fast on Sundays. So we've only got two days of Lent left, maybe from maybe by the time you're watching this you've only got two and a half days but we are, Lent is, you know, the end of Lent is right around the corner. We've just got Good Friday and Holy Saturday. And then we can, okay, don't, don't eat too much on Easter Sunday because you don't want to get sick. Yeah, I think I told you this, I, I think I told you this before. At one point on Mother's Day, um, uh, we, we were having a big meal and I, and I, and I had just finished, um, no, I hadn't finished Lent. I think I took a day off at that point in time because uh, it was one of the few days I was at home with my family. And I ended up eating way too much that day, and, and I ended up getting sick, which wasn't too fun. So try and eat with moderation, even after Lent finishes, okay? Your stomach's gonna, your stomach will have shrunk because of the reduced food intake. So don't eat too much that you end up getting sick. We've got the Holy Weekend ahead of us, Good Friday, Holy Saturday, and Easter Sunday. The three most important days in the Christian calendar. When our Lord was crucified, um, when he was in Perg sorry, no, not Perg when he was in the when he was in the limbo of the fathers, helping the souls there, and when he um, when he was resurrected on Sunday morning. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to do make a normal release this week because of the timing I'm spending on my uh, on my writing my dissertation, which is going it's going okay. I finished my formulative essay for glaciation in the late Devensian in Britain. And I just got that sitting in a in a in its place on my own on the university website, waiting for the deadline to pass. So I'll, I'll maybe look over that. I'll maybe look over that a couple of times to ensure that it's good quality. But right now I'm just focusing on my dissertation, trying to make sure I can get I can get through it as quickly as possible, but also with good quality. This isn't the first time I've written something like a dissertation, so hopefully I can try and use that. Uh, small amount of experience in trying to make my work sound more academic and then after that I can send it to my lecturer who hopefully I, I plan to send a copy of my this a copy of my dissertation to him at the beginning of next week so he can read it and tell me if there's anything he needs to improve on it and then hopefully by the end of next sorry hopefully by the end of next week I can send him another copy and we hopefully that uh, um, I can continue to revise my dissertation further and get that ready for the deadline when it when it inevitably arises i plan to do a lot of um i plan to do a lot of drafts hopefully trying to make sure my work is as high as quality as possible but clearly from that ex ex explanation you can see that i'm going to be quite busy which is why this video isn't too long so main point about this video is i finished one assessment now i'm on to my dissertation Please pray that I do well in that and also everyone else who is doing their dissertations. And have a good Holy Week, Holy Weekend, you know, so have a good Maundy Thursday, uh, Good Friday, Holy Saturday and Easter Sunday. And hopefully next week I will be further along in my assessments and hopefully you won't be sick because of, um, you, because you ate too much on Easter Sunday. So even after this period of Lent, remember that Lent is meant to, Lent is meant to reform you. It's not just some sort of temporary thing. It's meant to reform you little by little. So remember that. Have a good holy weekend. See you. Uh, God bless you all. See you, see you in the next video, comrades. Until then.